Hello my loves, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm excited to share with you guys my summer lineup. So about a week ago, I shared all of my Chanel makeup lineup that I'm using for this summer and I have recently purchased. So I'm really excited to kind of go in depth with you guys as I promised on my Insta story that I will be doing that when I shared some of these makeups with you guys. So before we do, go ahead and jump into the full video. If you guys are enjoying my videos, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe button if you're not subscribed. Okay, um, so the first one that I'd like to show you guys is um, this velvet um, lipstick and it's Rouge Allure Velvet Extreme Line in the color 102 and it's called modern and of course it's uh, a little push and the lipstick comes out i'm actually absolutely loving the velvet um collection currently especially for the summer i'm not much of a big fan of super glossy in the summertime and i think i'm kind of going back to the roots of like not matte but the velvet look that I've always loved, I feel like I kind of strayed away from that and I wasn't really loving it. It wasn't me, so it wasn't really doing justice. Um, so let me just put a little, I can't really tell you guys what this looks like, but I will try to do like a little swatch. Remember guys, I'm not a boot, uh, I'm not booty. <laughs> I am not a beauty guru here, so I'm doing my best. So it is a really nice, um, I would say like a nude, but definitely a much more like natural nude lip color. It has more life to it, very similar to the lip liner that I have, which kind of blends well with it. Um, and the lip liner that I have actually, I literally just had the lip liner and I added the lipstick. I have the um, Le Crayon um, Longwear lip, li uh, lip Pencil in Rose Natural uh, 158. So. This is what I had on initially. I'm not sure if I'm showing you guys. Oh, again, not a beauty guru. So remember that guys, you guys do sometimes give me a lot of, uh, you know, judgment on these things. And I'm just sharing what I love with you guys. So I'm not a beauty professional by all means. I'm, I'm not, I'm just, you know, sharing this with you guys. And then I also have the, um, blush and i absolutely love this gorgeous luxurious packaging of course who doesn't love that so i have this in 80 jersey so i'm going to also show you guys this i will also try to you know link how many also's can i say but i will link um all these products if you know they are available online i will link them below and I am going to try to show you guys the color, but I have to say like I kind of um, used it and it kind of went around. <laughs> so excuse me on that. Um, let's see. Okay, so here's the color. It's like a really nice, um, it has like several tones to it. It has rosy tone to it. And then it also has like a nice bronzy tone to it. I don't know if that makes sense. But ultimately, it is pretty rosy. Um, by the way, it comes with like this little brush. I don't know how they use this. It's really cute and all, but honestly, does not really serve as anything for me. Like, it does not do a good job. So, I don't even know. So, if you guys can like tell, let me see. I'm gonna try to do it. And I love that it has a little bit like of a shine to it. And ultimately, my summer looks, what I like is like a nice glowy look. So I don't know if you guys can tell. It does definitely have a lot of like a rose, like a really natural, again, very close to the lip color, like a natural nude color to the cheek. So it has a little bit of brown, a little bit of rose. So if you want that glowy, natural, you know, look, it will definitely give you that. You do definitely have to go in there and like put your brush in there really well if you want to get the color. So I definitely have to say on the pigmentation, it's not as easy to put and apply. So you do need like a really good brush to apply this. But overall, I think it's very beautiful and it's like a really nice natural flush color. And um, just overall, it's not like a super intense blush. So if you want something like that, I would not recommend this. 
um, maybe a different color but yeah it's not an intense one it's really I feel like meant to be like for you know like a very Parisian very minimal makeup look so if you like that and you're into that definitely try it so I needed a foundation and I always kind of like alternate through foundations if you have noticed I, I do mention and I ended up getting this one I have actually been like you know keeping my eye on this and I'm not sure I don't remember if I've tried this one before I think I have it's the uh, less beige um tint uh, natural Hydrant. Okay, this is all like, okay, I'm gonna jump into the American version here. Healthy glow, foundation, hydration, and long wear. So for summer, of course, what do I want? I want hydration, and I want a healthy glow, and I want it to be very lightweight. And this is a water base more so, I believe. Um, if I am not mistaken, um, it is kind of like a water base foundation. So don't quote me on that though. Don't come after me. Um, but yeah it is like in this beautiful sleek packaging it is not like a very large size i got it in b20 i did get it in a little bit of a darker shade than i would normally do let's say like in the winter time so i've been loving it so far it's very lightweight mixes with your skin what i love about it is that it's extremely soft it almost feels like you are putting on a nice like gel like you know those cooling lotions when you're putting it on and almost throughout the day you kind of see it really working well even if you sweat you know what you can't wear a foundation and be like i'm not going to sweat and like if you guys can see i'm like glowing and that's probably because i am i have already sweated or whatever it is right so but you do want a foundation that kind of moves with you throughout the day if that makes sense so that you stay glowing, you don't look like, you know, your foundation is cracking and it's not really blending with your skin. So this foundation, I would definitely say, does a great job keeping that natural look and just blending with your skin over time. So even if it starts like fading away, you don't see cracks or anything like that. It just really gives you, again, like a very hydrated look. So if you want to sometimes blot down any of that and like kind of chill it down and have a little bit more of a velvety mattifying look you can definitely do that with maybe a powder but i honestly i just enjoy this glowy you know maybe slightly looking like you know i spritz water on my face i know a lot of people use these essences you really don't need that with this one you don't um and again totally love it going to show you guys the bottom because it is the color shade so if you guys are similar to my color shade maybe you guys oh i don't think it's really anyways it's not um capturing it so it's b20 and yeah definitely and i think they came out with um a new version of this it might be the 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 water base one i'm not sure i'm not sure if this is water based fully but please do let me know down below if you guys know specifically but yeah the, these are basically my latest um summer lineup from chanel hope you guys enjoyed it it's just a very you know natural neutral glowy look for the summer i'm absolutely loving it um and yeah i i don't know like i went through like this phase where i wasn't really wearing makeup and then i was like i do want to wear makeup in the summertime but i do want to wear the type of makeup where you know it's still natural and it's super lightweight and it makes you look very beautiful so i would definitely say this does the job um again if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to hit that like button and if you're not subscribed to my channel then make sure to subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys soon love you guys all Mwah. bye bye